That moves us on to another crazy game. Last game of the week, uh, Ravens versus Cowboys here. This is a huge game. The 0-2 Ravens versus the 1-1 Cowboys. Uh, this really, this game really hinges on the Ravens season right now. I don't see them really pulling it out at the very end. They may, they're definitely going to get some wins, make it close, but they're not going to be able to, they're going to be fighting for the wild card until the final week of the year. If they don't get a win here, uh, Cowboys, they look terrible last week against the saints. I don't know if it's because the saints are just so good now, or if the Cowboys are just very, very mediocre. CD lamb was seen with an ankle injury this week as well. So that's a little concerning for Dex favorite target. I believe nice uh, I believe Jake Ferguson is back practicing this week, so that that should help out their offense quite a bit over there in Dallas. But it's a dome game. It's going to be a fun, exciting game. Uh, Three twenty-five slates, so we cover all the slates right here. I'm excited for it. Looking forward to Hell it yeah. big time. Yeah, but Zay Flowers has been going off, and so continue to expect him to do so. Derrick Henry continue to expect him to not do a whole lot because. It's the Lamar show. I think the Cowboys are really going to suffer this year without having a true, true running back. And I think that's the, that's the main reason. Also that defense is not good, but, but without having a running back, that offense does struggle quite a bit. Do you the think, Ravens? Oh, sorry. Go ahead, Sean. Do you think that John Harper would be closer to a hot seat after this? If they lose this game, just and coming off the season of it doesn't go very well. Just coming off of an AFC championship, it, this season would have to go horrendous for yeah. John Harbaugh. I think he has every bit of of support from that front office and that organization just because he's been there so long. I think it would actually have to take him quite a few years of bad performances, probably two or three, for them to to want to move on. And by that time, John would most likely be be ready to retire. I don't think he's I don't think he'll ever be on the hot seat there in that in that organization. No, no, he won't be. He's like Mike Tomlin at the Steelers. They get to they they'll they'll leave when they want to leave. At the end of the day, I didn't ever know it was going to be a situation like he's been there so long. They're just very comfortable with him. They just need a new face in there to switch it up. Will they have Lamar no. on this contract or? No, no, he gets they they both get to leave when they want to leave, for sure. I don't think the the front office isn't going to tell him anything. They might bring well, the up the question is... like, "Hey, you've had a bad season or two. Like maybe you think it's time, but like, yeah. not going to be like." Get out now. Yeah. <laughs> None the of that. Is, is None like, of that. John, John for that team is more like structural. He's a special mm -hmm. teams coach. He's not the offensive coordinator. He's not the defensive coordinator. He's the guy who oversees everything and brings guys in. So the first thing that's going to happen is if this is a, a another blunder of a season or or, or so, if somebody's going to be on a hot seat, it's going to be one of the coordinators. It's either the defense mm -hmm. didn't step up or the offense isn't performing. We need to get another guy in here. It's not it's not ever going to be John until he he retires. Mm -hmm. I've never seen a good uh a good a good working team with uh with a special teams coach as the head coach. I've never witnessed it with the exception of John Harbaugh. Do you think since Jim's back in the NFL he's taken all the Harbaugh power away from John? No, he had it when he they, when he played against him in the Super Bowl. He won it permanently in the Super Bowl. <laughs> gonna, he wants to take it back. Oh, he's going to try. He's going to try. Uh, oh, all right. Man. Well, that's going to wrap it up for uh, games of the week. We now move into our <laughs> pick'em. So Congratulations, Sean. You know how to do a transition from one topic to another. Congratulations. By the way, how many fines is that? That, that uh, I got to, we got to, that's, that's definitely fine. We, what? Huh? What? A fine. Yeah, who's getting a fine? Who are you me, saying gets a fine? Me, I am getting a fine oh. for what I did. In he's, so funny, <laughs> he's finding himself. He's yeah, finding I, that's himself. a fine on me like for what I did times games of the week. Through the, through the, the preview shows. Uh, yeah. Tybo, you're yeah, listening to this, I'm so sure. Bad. Write him up. If not, <laughs> yeah, I guess he gets away scot-free. So Unless bad. he wants to tell on himself, this guy.